Hey there everybody, what's up? How you doing? Hopefully things are going great for all of y'all. And uh, hopefully all y'all are getting your summer plans situated, especially since the weather is starting to turn a little bit warmer. And I think it'll be kind of nice this year. Anyways, I know you guys are excited for this week's reaction video, so we're going to just jump into that. Now, I don't know much about this week's video. I do know that he's apparently a newer comedian and that this video did come from Instagram. So um, I'm excited. I don't know about you guys, but I am. But of course, we won't know until we kind of just get into it. So you know what? Let's see how this goes. Are you guys gonna start a fight here? <laughs> so what do you say, miss? What do you say? Go ahead. One person, one person. Let's start with her. I'm born in Quebec, but I moved to Ontario. You're born in Quebec, but you moved to Ontario. Okay, let's... Oh, okay, look. Canadian. Interesting. What the <laughs> fuck? Like, Box H wants to fight with Box C over there. <laughs> oh, okay, I see what this is. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? And it's all women. What the fuck happened? Look at dudes are like, uh, since the Me Too movement, we can't say shit. <laughs> uh, sit down, look at the fucking floor. <laughs> while these women act all belligerent. <laughs> it's white women too. Look, the Indians are like, what's happening? I, <laughs> I don't these people. Oh, we got another one. All right, see, another woman. Fuck it. It's, and it's the same demographic, too. It's like always women between the ages of divorce and menopause, like right there. It's <laughs> <laughs> uh, very specific uh, age group. Unfortunately, you pay two taxes in Quebec. I know. It bothers <laughs> the hell out of me. It does. <laughs> Does she not so realize he's messing with her? They all get mad at you like that. Okay, hey, this is comedy, not therapy. <laughs> oh, she's waving that finger. What is it? Amadou? Okay. He's from France? And, okay, and who are you? His lawyer? <laughs> <laughs> this white lady interfering. See that right there? You see that? That's white privilege right there. Right there. <laughs> That's white privilege. He's from France. You're Iraqi also? You're the happiest Iraqi I've ever seen in my life. So happy. I love this guy. <laughs> Man. Okay, relax. <laughs> this woman's taking everything so seriously. He's in America. Oh, Canadian guy. <laughs> Do you feel free now that this woman just <laughs> proclaimed your freedom? <laughs> How long have you been single? All your life? Okay. He's like, well, we're gonna hook him up then. <laughs> One lady was like, aww. I'll <laughs> suck his dick. <laughs> You're in America now. <laughs> but you got people are surprised, right? People are surprised. Like, well, how can Troy? You don't know anything? What happened? Well, she was asking me what Tennessee was, and I was like, I don't know. You know what Tennessee is? I'll tell you. I fucking know. <laughs> is it red or blue? Okay, listen. It's very white. <laughs> She's like, no, you're wrong. A lot of blacks. <laughs> That's a red state right there. <laughs> Jermaine just fucking left, huh? <laughs> he just left. He's like, I fucking have. Huh? One chicken wing left. Who left? One chicken wing left. One chicken. He has one chicken wing left? Yeah. So, who would do that? I don't know. <laughs> There's a little bit of racism in what you were saying. <laughs> <laughs> you know, when you said that? It uh, did get very quiet. Chicken wing. We thought uh, he would put it in his pocket or something. 
Uh, how do black people need chicken wings? I've seen BET, <laughs> they don't need chicken wings at all. I live in the Galleria area, and um, <laughs> and from what I know in terms of urban knowledge, radiologist. And then what, what else? Oh, Jermaine, where'd you go? <laughs> Jermaine, let me tell you what happened when you left. <laughs> That was said that I need to talk to you about. Don't eat that chicken wing. <laughs> <laughs> Don't touch that thing. <laughs> All right, so that was pretty funny. I really did enjoy that. Apparently, he goes by the name of Sugar Sammy, and I do believe that I've seen at least one of his clips through social media. And he's pretty funny from what I can tell. I mean, it seems like he's kind of on the spot. He might be a little bit more improv than anything else. Uh, but I do like, you know, his vibe on stage, and that's really good. Now, the one thing I've never really understood, and I don't think I ever will, is why anybody wants to be that one person that stands out in the crowd during one of these shows. Because, I mean, at that point, you become the target for the comedian. At that point, then you are the one thing that they're going to focus on, and it never ends well. But, I mean, they keep doing it to each of their own, I guess. But for me, I, I don't think I'd ever want to be the, that person at a comedian show because... It doesn't seem like it ever ends well. <laughs> it makes for great content for, for the comedian, but for that person, I feel like they go home a little bit angry. Either way though, I really did enjoy this video. Hopefully you did too. If you did, please make sure to hit the like and subscribe buttons down below. Also make sure to hit that little notification button, that way you guys know when I drop my next video. And if you get the chance, check out my Twitch streams on Wednesdays and Fridays, just check my page for the times. Also, if you do get the chance, please check out the socials, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. I do update those periodically. Well, thanks for joining me here today, everybody. Stay spicy, my friends.